So people who have flown the P-47 know that it can take a few hits. And they also know that it's a pretty good performer at high altitude. We're up at 20,000 feet here. But can we shoot it down in our 109K? Rightio, here we go. P-47's just over there. We're going to, of course, merge and go around, try and keep a visual on him. Pretty difficult with the uh, framing and the canopy here. Oh well, we've got visual on him pretty easily. He's also a pretty big aircraft, pretty big target, should be pretty easy to hit. Okay, now we basically just have to get closer to him. Okay, here we go. He's a bit far for us to be accurate. Okay, did that hit? Doesn't look like it. Doesn't look like it either. I think they're all going behind. Don't know if that hit. Okay, we, we hit his wing just then. That's good. He's flying level. What are you doing? Try and evade. Oh, there we go. Knocked off his flap by the looks of it. Let's try opening up with a 30 mil. Gotta line him up though. Oh, there's definitely some damage done then. Why? Careful, buddy. Oh, God, we stalled. Stalled a wing. Okay, he's still in the fight for a bit. He's probably got a few minutes until he's absolutely knackered. Uh, depending on what we hit, don't know, but it does look like he's leaking oil, so that is going to go in our favour eventually. Okay. Oh, stalling. This is a bit tricky to control up here. Jug's a lot easier to control up here. I've already done it in a playlist. He's got one of his flaps down. I don't know if he did that on purpose or if it's just a, a result of us hitting like, the hydraulic line or something. Hydraulic pipes or whatever. Okay, I can hear him now. We got close enough. You're really struggling for control, definitely. Can't turn too well. Come on! We're not... We can't roll very well. We're doing a bit over 200 k's an hour. We're up quite high as well. Yeah, I'm rolling to the right, and it just wants to roll to the left. Okay. Okay, here we go. Going down, we're gaining a bit of speed here. Above 300. Okay. We hit something, and he's going mega slow. Kerfurst doesn't like going slow at these altitudes. The jug, though, it'll do it all day. Okay, don't want to throttle up too quickly, because it's very easy to over-rev this engine. Probably could have fired a couple of shots at him then. We'll see if we can get a couple of shots off here. 
No, he's too high. What is he doing? Die already, you bastard. He is leaking oil, so it will... He will eventually kind of conk out. We've lost a bit of altitude, but we're still up relatively high. Okay, losing altitude, that goes in our favour. We hit him a couple of times then. There we go. I took his elevator, uh, not elevator, rudder off by the looks of it. Yep, that's a rudder off. There we go, he's on fire. He's not going to last very long now. He's still going though. Pilot hasn't jumped out. We probably killed killed the pilot. Yeah, he's just he's probably going to die. That was probably it. Let's have a look at the damage we did to him. Uh, yeah, we did take out his pilot. We also filled him full of holes. That just goes to demonstrate the resilience of the jug. Knocked off a bit of his uh, engine cowling. Better cooling, I guess, but it doesn't help too much when you're knocked out. Took off his flap as well. Yeah. So that was a, a victory for us. He's going to crash down there somewhere. I don't know where exactly he is. There he is. He's crashed into the ground. Okay. Time to check out the scoreboard. Right. So here's the scoreboard. We were up against the P-47 in our BF-109, and we won. Kind of unsurprisingly, but it did take a bit of time and a bit of work. Because, of course, the Jug is a very, very capable high-altitude fighter, and it's also very, very resilient. But, of course, we did end up winning. So, of course, that gives us five wins, zero losses, zero draws, and a win rate, therefore, of 100% in the... Well, this, this scoreboard's redundant. This one, not so much, but this one probably is. There are just nowhere near enough uh, different battles that we can do compared to like the Jets, where we can do one battle for each weapon type, as the Jets carry more than just a, a set of guns. So, yeah. Next time, P51. So make sure you're subscribed so you catch that. And I'll catch you next time.